Happy November 30th, everyone. I'm Liam, and we are playing the 2024 quest calendar, The Leaf Riders of Renwood. Yesterday, Ivy and party explored Timber Landing looking for the captain. We helped out a couple of citizens along the way and restocked our supplies at the market. Ivy spent 90 amber, and now she has two of everything that she wants to have two of. Um... We have 14 amber left over if we find some ice cream or something, I guess. And we eventually found the captain patrolling on the beaver dam, and that is where we left things. So let's see what adventure is on the calendar for us today. Captain Race Mudfoot is eager to get back to his rounds and seems too busy to discuss security matters with you. Okay. Uh, there's a pickpocket icon on here, so, um, there's the four-sided die. Here we go. Disco wanders off and comes back with two amber. We don't know where it came from, uh, but there it is. So, just like that, we're up to 16 amber. Okay, we have a choice here. We can either try to persuade the captain to listen. Uh, this is about the in impending insect attack. Um, so we can persuade him to listen, that's a charisma roll, or we can convince the captain of the imminent threat, and that's a strength roll. Reminder, intimidating. Um, that's, uh, Ivy's good at strength and intimidation. The calendar doesn't generally like that. Um, let's see what we've got going on here. Oh, boy. Uh, the captain has a lot to say. Here we go. Listen, we've got several tasks at hand here. Our top priority is safeguarding Renwood's border from the insect threat in the Ashlands. But we've also got the vital job of maintaining the dam and ensuring a steady flow of clean water to Crown Spire. In all my years commanding this outpost, we've done a stellar job keeping those insects at bay. And we've never had a breach in our defenses. I don't anticipate one anytime soon, and our scouts haven't picked up any intel indicating otherwise. We've got a decent number of resources dedicated to security, but we're constantly playing catch-up with maintenance and repairs. Unfortunately, we haven't received any official word about the state of affairs in Crown Spire, and we've had no orders from the Queen. It's been years since Her Grace has paid us a visit, and until we receive official orders, we will not deviate from our current plan. I assure you, we've got plenty of precautions and security measures in place. If there's ever a breach or any sign of danger to the kingdom, we'll light the signal fire. You might have noticed those signal fire posts along the road as you came in. Once we light ours, it'll trigger a chain reaction. Others will be lit until the message reaches Crown Spire. Okay, and now... <laughs> Now we're going to either persuade the captain or convince the captain. Uh, we're going to make the same rolls either way. So I guess we'll go with... Uh, Ivy will um, use intimidation. If your virtue is more than six... I, Ivy's is 16. We're going to gain a plus two bonus on this roll. Excellent. Um, okay. So, strength. Here we go. 6 plus 4 is 10, plus 2 is 12, plus 2 intimidating is 14. Um, we'd need a 16 for the best result. Ivy can do, she's got royal might. She can re-roll any strength roll, so let's do that. We can do this twice if we need to. There we go, and we won't need to. That's a 17. That's the best result all on its own, even without all of our bonuses. So... Um, Ivy intimidates the fine uh, beaver, and he responds, I see your point, and you do make a compelling argument. While we have been fortunate in the past to manage smaller insect attacks, it's prudent to acknowledge that unusual circumstances can arise. I'm willing to consider your advice and take some precautionary measures. Let's work together to ensure the safety of Timber Landing and Renwood as a whole. Your insights may prove invaluable in maintaining our border security. <laughs> Captain Race Mudfoot appears more open to cooperation, ready to listen to your suggestions, and potentially adapt his approach. Gain a plus four bonus on all rolls on the next page. That's excellent. Plus four. All rolls. 
The next page will be December 2nd. Because that, oh, hold on. I was going to end the thing here, but this is uh, Saturday and Sunday, so we can do the Sunday lottery. And we are here, uh, we're here in town, or in a town, I guess. And so why don't we just head on down to the local Sunday lottery office? We put, <laughs> we pay to Amber uh, and we lose. We flat out lose. So we're back down to 14. 14 amber and that my friends is november 30th and december 1st so we shall say goodbye for now and visit ivy and friends again on monday i hope you'll join us thanks for watching